These are eyelashes I got on Amazon. So you, to rip off, you can squish this plastic like this because if you rip on the end, you risk ripping it off like that where you still little piece left on there which have done sometimes they're a little too flat there we go so make sure it's rounded okay so now you see one is shorter one is longer so you're gonna apply this side to here and this side to here apply small amount of glue we don't need too much glue then we're gonna let it get tacky and then we're gonna take tweezers. I know there's different kind of tweezers, like the big tweezers, but I like these smaller tweezers. So we'll wait a little bit. Then we're gonna align it. I'm gonna land it like this without gluing it up first and then see you attach it. Important is the edges. Once you have the desired placement, then you can kind of tap it like this. Important thing to remember to not glue it too high on your skin because it's gonna disfigure your eyeshadow, your eyeliner. So be aware of that. Okay, I think I'm happy the way this looks. There you go. Then you let it dry. For the glue and it's going to um, be clear this kind of white glue they also sell black glue but it's more room for error with the black glue um, and then they sell like different glues like duo is good glue and there's like thrive organic non-toxic glue but really see what works for you is the better quality glue the better of course for your eyelash health but you know use eyelash primer that will help your eyelash health and it's important to never here i'm gonna create another one it's important to never rip your eyelash glue once you're done wearing them at night make sure you use eyelash let it get tacky wipe off if there's any excess. then you can curl them. Just be careful to not press too hard because then they get kind of like chunky and too square. Some of them are big so they don't fit. See, just like a gentle 